is Monday, 21st of August, 2023. You know the deal. Album of the week, episode four. This week, we will be talking about Pivot Gang's debut album, You Can't Sit With Us, released in 2019. Four years ago. Wow, it does not feel like this came out four freaking years ago. Quick thing, though, quick disclaimer, though. This actually is not my album of the week, really. It's not technically my album of the week. That would be Destiny by DJ Sabrina the Teenage DJ. That album is crazy, she's crazy. I'm gonna be talking about all of that in a video f for that album, and like a review, a review, a review. Yeah, I'm gonna be doing a review for that, like a dedicated video. Since that's getting its own video soon, I will instead be talking about another record I've been listening to, this one. Can't Sit With Us by Pivot Gang is an album that has been an extremely frequent comfort listen of mine since it released. It's not really the best at anything in particular. The group chemistry is cool. It's funny. There's some good quotables. The beats are very well produced. Good choruses, good feature guest spots. It's all good. I wouldn't say there's any particular thing about this record that's like mind-blowing. Everything is so clean and pristinely done and there's a lot of charm and heart in it. And that's the power of You Can't Sit With Us, in my opinion. This is a rap group from Chicago. They've been around for a while. They're fronted by one of the best hip-hop artists in the game right now, in my opinion, Saba. If you haven't listened to Saba's solo output, his last two albums are freaking phenomenal. They're wonderful records. He's one of the nicest voices in rap right now. And his warmth is felt across every single track here, whether it's one of the more calming, low-key ones or one of the more catchy hit tracks. He brings that same warmth and it's really nicely played off of through the other members that are definitely more kind of silly, goofy, particularly Joseph Chilliam. On Bad Boys, that SSX Tricky line, wonderful. Niggas moving snow like SSX Tricky. I don't fuck with rats, so I don't watch Disney steady talk. NFN Mello has a really unpredictable sort of melodic approach to some of his verses his voice kind of jumps around a lot in ways i don't expect which is always a delight to hear and the production is really like nimble precise and fluid like on mortal Kombat. really really like eerie loop on that track the opening track is is one of the nicest things you could open a record like this with you know those like fractured piano or guitar notes along with those like chopped up vocals <laughs> it's right away just kind of like hypnotizing i think it's a great intro and then you've got the more like up-tempo rampaging tracks like Bad Boys and Jason Statham Part 2. Smino comes on for a feature on the track Bad Boys and oh my god that chorus he, he delivers. When I first heard it I thought it was dreadful. It completely broke the vibe of the song into something new and I was like what the hell is Smino doing? But now it's like in contention for my favorite Enjoy moment pistons. on the whole album. <laughs> pushes his like high-pitched voice to go like pew, 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 pew. It's a nice moment on the record that reminds me that there are no like barriers here. These are just pals making music, enjoying themselves. And there's moments like this that kind of bring that to the forefront. Studio Ground Rules as well is a really playful track. Much more low-key, slower song. One of the comfiest on the record. I think my overall favorite beat here has got to be uh, Colbert. The tr second track, man, the freaking guitars on this song are so nice. Mm. One sec, let me check that flight at old hair. In my glow like a super saiyan with gold hair. We like guys and we send in signs like a roll flare. Best feature on the record, Mick Jenkins on No Vest. His incredibly just cold and stern delivery fits that beat so perfect. Niggas really shoot like Dion Waiters. It's a mess. It's beyond hating at this point. Ain't never had the Matrix flesh to dodge your shit. I feel like Neo, nigga. Trying to put me in a box. I felt like Neo, nigga. I find it extremely hard to have an issue with anything about this record. There are some corny lines here and there. Some of the beats are merely okay. You know, mathematics hero in particular don't blow me away it's not like every single track's a firework display but honestly this is just such a great consistent reliably relaxing hip-hop record that i have just found myself coming back to so consistently over the course of its lifespan so far and i see myself doing so in the future and i'm excited to see where they go especially now that of course 
one of their founding members, Squeak Pivot, passed away. I mean, that was horrible news, especially considering, on top of that, one of their founding members, uh, John Walt, years ago, also, he was he got killed in a shooting, if I'm not mistaken. Horrible stuff, man. The fact that two of these members of this, of this group have died since their inception is just, just horrible. And they're still able to come out of it on top, making really nice, wholesome, enjoyable music. It's a really inspiring thing to see. I'm looking forward to seeing whatever the future is of this group, because they do make some really beautiful music. And that that's uh, my album of the week this week kind of but yeah <laughs> let me know what yours has been what you've been listening to if you have heard this record what do you think of it you tell me your opinions and stuff please do thank you and i'm gonna go back to listening to some music and i'll let you know what my next favorite thing is next week it kind of feel like an orgy fuck you doing telling us to stop you don't even have the authority that nigga broke your heart come and fuck with me you'll never get hurt again i'm trying to eat your pussy after i take you out like francis ferdinand skip them other niggas like some uno cards and it's your turn again stop trying to fuck with them hats off like when bobby Schmurter dance you don't gotta trim your bush you don't gotta edward scissorhands i'm trying to talk to whoever in charge man fuck a middleman you fuck